Hello, I'm going to be talking about my all-time favourite shoe designers, Camper. And I thought I would make a video about their spring and summer collection. And even though um, we're coming into autumn now, some of these shoes are still available online and in some of the Camber stores. I saw one of the pairs that I'm going to be talking about on sale, in fact, um, online and in one of the stores. The the shoes that I have been probably wearing the most this summer are this pair of shoes and they are called Laura and they're really um, comfortable and that's why I love um, buying camper shoes because all their shoes not only have a unique beautiful design but they're extremely comfortable to wear. I saw these when they first came out and I was in I was it was around about April in London and the weather was really not warm at all but because I really love all the camper shoes I like to generally buy ahead of time and so I thought, well, I'd better buy these now because i better go to Camper now to see what the new collection is like because I don't want to not be able to um, find out that they're no longer available and no longer in stock. So I, my favourite store in London is the Camper store in the Royal Arcade, which is um, a Victorian, um, rather beautiful arcade with little um, boutiques within with all different sorts of different shops like a chocolate shop and um, a op optometrist and all kinds of uh, shops like a perfume shop but one of the shops is Camper and um, I love the collection in the Royal Arcade because it's quite glamorous and um, they often have quite a lot of the limited editions and um, I think that I've seen shoes in that particular shop which are not in all the other stores, although every single camper shop in London um, has a different collection, which is really nice because that means that if you go to, say, the camp shop in Covent Garden, you will find shoes that you cannot buy in the Royal Arcade, and if you go to the camper shop store, say for example off Carnaby Street, again you'll have a complete, a slightly different collection to the ones in Covent Garden. So you know you're not going to find everyone wearing the same shoes as you. And so these really caught my eye. There's a little zip on the side. It's very easy to slip on and off. Right. And the sole is rubber. And it's uh, the good thing about the rubber sole is that it grips so well. So no matter how high the shoes are, you're always going to feel very secure. Uh, there's lots of aeration for your feet in the summer. The tan colour is something that goes with absolutely everything that I've been wearing. The reason why I have worn these shoes so much is because I've been going from um, day things, casual day wear, to evening wear and although these are not really dressy they are really comfortable and very beautiful and sleek and you can um, wear them um, as an evening look they're not really obvious evening but they look a little bit more dressy than you know if you go around in the summer just wearing flat sandals uh, so or, or flip-flops and they're very beautiful simple and elegant and I love the contrast between the dark brown leather and the sort of almost white birch not sure what sort of um, wood the, the wedge heels are made of but uh, the heels are incredibly light and in the summer um, they've been perfect because you don't want to wear something that feels really clumpy and heavy. Um, this this style also comes in different colourways. I saw a very sophisticated um, pair that looked like the same design as this but there was this very uh, beautiful beige top and a sort of um, dark, maybe it was a black or very dark grey um, or charcoal colour um, for the bottom um, leather strap and that just looked so gorgeous. I saw that in um, one of the campus stores last week 
and I think it was on sale, I think, and I was so tempted to buy them. And I remember round about spring of this year, there were lots of really high wedge sandals, like this high, and um, the straps would go up to here, and they looked gorgeous, uh, really high fashion. And But I just thought, I these are not wearable. So I thought there would be absolutely no point getting them. So these are absolutely wonderful shoes. Talk about um, another gorgeous pair of shoes that I bought from, um, again, Camper. And I'm going to uh, show you what they look like on my feet. And here they are. And um, I did wear these in a concert. Um, now, when was the concert? It was in... Ooh, June, and uh, I think quite a lot of people noticed my shoes, and I think they're brilliant because they have very unusual design. When you look at them from the front, you can see my toes peeping out, um, but the immediate thing is that there's this lovely orange-red, which is really stunning, I think, and... Um, at the same time, you've got this contrast of the white stripe. It's sort of like, um, it's it slightly raised, this white stripe. And um, the, the shape of the front is pointed. If you can see, it's a very pointy front. And at the, on the side, um, you do have a, a rubber sole, but what is amazing is the rubber sole has been brought up so it almost becomes part of your arch. So it makes you look as if you've got, I don't know, very arched feet. There's and also, um, at the same time, you've got this open back, so it's almost like a, almost like a sandal shoe. <laughs> what is also um, lovely about these is that very often when you have, say, court shoes, and this is a sort of unusual form of a, a court shoe in a way, is that you'll often have um, the, the end of the shoe and the beginning of the heel. Um, you'd have like, you know, you'd have the end here and then the heel would be maybe in a different, um, in a different, it might be kind of wood or rubber, but everything is all blended into one, so it's almost like sculptural. The whole thing is one form. It's sort of a rounded, slightly pointy form. Um, and some of the seams have been shown, the stitching here, but what has been shown is unusual. It's not actually the structure um, of a typical shoe. The first thing I thought when I saw these was that it's, it reminds me of architecture. You know, it's more of a concept shoe um, than um, a typical shoe. Um, I did do a tiny bit of research about these, and these are part of um, a, a collaboration that Camper have been... Um, it's a project that Camper have been involved in, collaborating with um, various designers in, um, in the world. Uh, mainly Europe, I think, and they've been collaborating with designers on limited editions since, I would say, 2008, I think, and this is part of um, the um, Together collection, and I think this was um, a limited edition collection of shoes, so I bought these in, I think it was May, or maybe it was April, in, again, the Royal Arcade in, um, in Bond Street. So um, this, um, this design project, this particular collaboration, um, was designed by the Barcelona Design Centre um, for Camper. And I did notice when I went into um, the Camper store when I bought them, they had amazing colours in, in this Together collection, in the Ma collection. There was a grass green which had a similar sort of moulded feel, architectural feel about it, but it had sort of a slightly kind of, um, there was a little bow, kind of a moccasin-y sort of bow 
front and um, there was a sort of acid yellow pair which I loved and there was also um, a black pair which um, was a little bit more formal looking but very very striking. Um, I bought the orange red pair because I thought that this colour would suit me. <laughs> if I could afford to I, I would have bought the lot. So uh, and that's the same with the other sandals um, that I showed you, the tan sandals. I would buy um, all of them. <laughs> okay, on to uh, the last pair that I'm going to be talking about.